half. You must be delighted with that performance. You could have been two or three more. Yes, I mean, we had. Well, we were sitting here on Saturday after the game and, and uh, speaking about how good we have done it, but in the end, uh, didn't get points. And today, uh, we played the same, and the only difference was that we scored them twice and uh, turned things around like this against Chelsea. I mean, this doesn't happen very often, but uh, even more proud I am for putting such a performance on the pitch today after. After an intense game on Saturday against this side, I think it was fantastic to watch, and uh, uh, the atmosphere in the crowd in the, gr in the ground was was sensational, and um, that carried us over the last 15 minutes where we were sometimes under pressure because we didn't score the third goal, what was definitely possible for us in the second half that would make it a little bit easier in the end. Uh, but uh, yeah. Overall, everything very positive. The only thing that is a little bit uh, and, uh, disappointing is the, the injury of, of Romeo because uh, it looks that he is out, out for longer. Hopefully, not too long. But but uh, this is the only thing. It's what 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 is a little bit dis disappointing. Just one question on Romeo as well because <coughs> standing ovation from all four sides of the ground when he came off for such a young kid. He seems incredibly excited prospect. Yes, but you see, uh, two intense Premier League games in three days is a completely yeah, unknown experience for these guys. And uh, we have to be careful in the future. And I think this is also something that I can take on my side that I don't. Uh, I, I have to look more careful about uh, how much we can, we can force them showing their qualities. And, and uh, now he's out for long, and this is not good. Just a word of even for DR. Yes, I think the decision was the right one today to go with him and with Romeo on the six. We changed the shape in 4 2 3 1. We had uh, two very dynamic sixes today on the pitch, and Browsey on the 10 is, is you, you, you know that he always does the work for uh, for two players, yeah? and this is what you need to have on, the, on, on these uh, positions. And then you have with Moy and Arma, also two players, they were working on the winger positions, unbelievable hard, Shea up front, the same. Uh, the shape is perfect in the moment for him, and uh, the wingers, I mean, for Arma, I'm very happy because he had it not always easy here, and, and it wasn't always as easy to, f to, to find a, a position where he can show up how he could he is. And, Today he, he worked unbelievable for the team and scored a beautiful goal, so fantastic. Do you feel with Proceed in the number 10 position you get more angles of pressure around this Chelsea midfield? Uh, no, but uh, I think uh, today it was more important to have the workload on these three positions. And when you have this, then you can put pressure on them. You don't have to defend so deep like in the last 15 minutes because it's always dangerous. You cannot do this against this team. This is why we decided to go a little bit higher today, press them a little bit earlier. And it worked quite well. We had 10 minutes in the first half where we have scored a goal where it looked like phew, super tough to defend, but uh, we didn't change it because we knew it's not always like this. We, we had, yeah, from five situations we could defend four, and then the one time you need to have luck or a good goalkeeper or the last pass not perfect from them, and that, that is okay. Dan? It's early days, Ralph, but how significant can a result like this be not only for the team, but for uh, the ownership for you and the staff with the, with the kind of approach you've taken over the summer to recruitment, how significant can this be that you think we are on the right track? Every, every positive result is important for the self-confidence, for the belief, for the way you want to work and, and uh, I mean, I could see a lot of see things in, in, in this game today what, what uh, was based on, on the clear very hard work for the last two days, and that doesn't mean on the pitch, um, more behind the scenes. And 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 uh, when you have young lads, where we very often speak about the empty hard disk, and you put the right stuff on it, and then they don't think about it a lot. Then they go out there and play how you ask them to do, and and this is fantastic when they have the quality, and this is fantastic to watch. So I just ask specifically about um, Bella Kocha, because you know, eight million pounds from Bochum, and he's playing. Yeah, I must say, it is maybe surprising, but um, when you see his physically, um, 
yeah, quality he has, then it it is perfect for the Premier League, and this is what we what we hoped in the summer. I was more questioning if he if he has the right mindset, but it seems that the Premier League is for him so interesting and so so forcing that he is fully focused and this combination of of being self-confident very self-confident and then going in such a league and showing this is a, a good combination and uh, then you need good performances immediately that you get self-confidence and this is what he what he has done so far and, and uh, uh, very very impressive to watch how he how he defends there I think the best scene today was the one against three and it was not a goal eh? because this is uh, quite impressive, yeah. Oh. Hi, Ralph. Um, seven points now in the Premier League, and all seven have come from games where you were losing or kind of trailing at one point. Does that say a lot about the, uh, the squad harmony and, and that? Yeah, it says a lot about uh, the willing to turn things around. Uh, I think we had a different history in the past, I know this. Uh, we are trying to turn things around and we had a lot of changes in the summer, we had a lot of new players in, uh, try to make things new and it seems that uh, we are going in the right direction. And can I ask about Oriol Romeo as well, not in the match day squad today, is he leaving before the end of the transfer Um We are not sure because uh, yeah, we know about the injury of, of, of Romeo Lavia now and we must have a look what we do. Okay, Tom. Ralph, is it? All the more satisfying when you uh, performance a result like that against a team like Chelsea who are spending so much money this summer. Yeah, but um, I mean, you can you can count together the players we have bought and what 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 they have bought. But this is not what is interesting. Before you go in such a game, it's it's eleven against eleven. They have not one man more on pitch, and in the end we. We have always the chance to compete against them, and, and this is what we tried today from the first moment on. And I think uh, the belief was there even after the f conceding the goal. Last year we were falling apart and, and uh, lost the game immediately. This this year we are resilient more and, and competitive more, and and to don't accept that something doesn't work. And then I could always feel that in every set piece we are dangerous, that we are uh, uh, against the ball, very stable. Don't give a lot of chances away, and this is a good combination. Um, Ralph, just on, he's the first uh, player born in 2004 to score a goal in the Premier League. <laughs> um, I mean, it's, it's a great start, isn't it? And obviously, we talk about his, his youth, but what is it that has put him in this position despite his? We are the, the pre season. They're arriving here and immediately showing how good he can play football. And then this is this is what I mean. We have our arguments when we have, when we when we take players, uh, especially for the young players. We have good arguments, I think, and uh, they know this, and that's the reason why they're coming to us. And then uh, last year it was Tino who was immediately starting. This year it was Kevin and him, and uh, yeah, this is the way we want to go.